I've actually had a few people ask me <laughs> if I got my boobs done and no, I do not have a disposable 10 grand. Hey guys, my name is Tessa and today we are going to be talking all about bras and boobs and the gym and finding the right fit for the girls. Recently, Gymshark has launched a new campaign. It's called the Bra Campaign and they have come out with six different sports bras ranging from low impact to medium impact to high impact. We're gonna really just talk about them, break them down because we all have that one bra that just fits so nicely. We choose it over all the other bras we have even though we probably have hundreds of sports bras at this moment in time, I know I do, but there's always like one bra that I go towards because it just makes me feel good about myself. It fits good. It, you know, it's comfortable. The reason why Gymshark came out with so many bras recently is to just kind of make it easier for people to figure out what they want and for them to find something that's actually comfortable for them so they can feel the most confident in their workout and when they're at the gym. I've honestly had moments where I'm wearing a sports bra and I look over and all of a sudden I am spilling out the sides, I'm spilling out the top, or I've had moments where I wear a sports bra and it just, it's so low or it goes too high, it's suffocating, it's too tight, the straps are confusing, and it's just, it could be, it can be really frustrating. You shouldn't have to make it work because it's your body and the clothing should fit you. You shouldn't have to force yourself to fit the clothing. Being a competitor, my body fat can go really low and in off season it fluctuates. So I'm always changing up here and I find that my selection of sports bras kind of changes with my body and it's hard to really find something that fits so perfectly. So, you know, when you find that perfect bra, it's like, Hallelujah, thank God. Today I'm gonna try all of these bras on for you and we're gonna talk about them and it's gonna be great. Just a little piece of information before we start. I typically wear a size extra small just because I don't really have that big of a chest. So all the sizes I'm gonna be talking about today are an extra small. I did, however, get a few of these bras in size small because I wanted to kind of test out how a different size would fit. So I'm gonna be talking about that as well. And just for reference, my bust measurement is 92 centimeters which is 36.2 inches and I'm five foot one and I typically wear a size 32 B bra however that definitely changes whether or not I'm on season or off season so uh, those are just my basic measurements so um, hopefully that information will help you determine a size first bra we're going to talk about is the low support bra so this is the low support bra I love this one reason being it's got this nice kind of rounded V neck and um, it does have removable cups now that I'm seeing my chest on the screen I'm like yeah I actually do have boobs because <laughs> I've been flat chested all my life so I think um, I think I'm just a late bloomer <laughs> anyways back to the bra um, <laughs> yeah, so this is for low support. So, you know, if you don't really need that much support, say you're, you're just doing like a super chill workout or, you know, going on a hike or something, I feel like this would be perfect. It's super comfy. The, uh, the strap, it kind of reminds me of those Lululemon bras that just have the, the thin straps because these are so thin. That's kind of what it reminds me of. This is the back of the bra. So you see you only have this one little thing here which I actually really prefer because a lot of the time when there's a lot of stuff going on in the back, it's just hard to get it on. <laughs> I really like this for just something comfortable, comfortable hike. This is a size extra small. I personally find this to be a little bit tight on me. So I feel like if I were to get this based on my measurements, I would probably get a size small, but it does fit pretty good. Like it's, if there are any boys watching this, can you just stop? So this comes in three different colors. It comes in Dusky Sage, Powdered Yellow, which is the one I'm wearing. Uh, fun fact, yellow is actually my all-time favorite color. It's been my favorite color since I was um, a little girl, so I had to go with the yellow. And then it comes in black. Overall, I really like this one. Super chill. And then you have the Gymshark logo right there. I just like it. I like the really, I like really simple things, like the simplicity of this bra. So. Um, yeah, 
I like this bra. And another thing is the way that it goes up like this and then has that one strap in the back, it creates like a halter effect, which from experience makes your delts look really good. The next bra we're gonna talk about, this is the low medium support. So it's got the rounded neckline. I love this bra because it has this. This is like the scrunch butt of bras. It is so cute. I seriously, I am in love with this bra. It's got um, the black logo, which I really like. It makes it pop. This bra also has the crossover straps, which are adjustable, which is super helpful. I'm not sure if you guys can see, but it does have a little mesh. This bra also does have removable cups. And again, with the halter, just like the last bra, it's got those thin straps, which I really, really like. I really like when there's thin straps. I did get these guys in a size extra small, and I feel like they fit really good. Like they fit perfectly. I'm not in any discomfort. It's not too tight or anything. Um, I really like the way this fits. So this low to medium impact bra comes in four colors. You have your basic white and black, which are huge staples, and then you have your Neo Lime, which I really like. I think this is such a dope color. Like, the camera is not doing it justice. It is really, really bright. And it also comes in the color Blue Stone. So side note, there is another bra. I actually don't have that one, so I'm not able to talk about it. However, it's the medium support one. It's got a zipper in the front, and I can imagine it would be fairly similar to these ones that I'm gonna talk about. So these are medium to high support. These bras are the ones that I decided to get a size bigger than what I usually get, and I am quite happy that I did that just because I find the higher support the bra, the, the tighter it is, obviously, and um, sometimes it can just be a little bit too tight and it's incredibly hard to get on and incredibly uncomfortable. So I am glad that I made the decision to go up a size for these. As you can see, like they offer a lot of support. Back is actually like a bra where you can adjust it. Um, it's got this little mesh paneling here. It has racer back straps, which are adjustable. And what else is the cups for this bra are actually sewn into the bra. So you can't take them out. Like you can see the cup is actually like a part of the bra, which is super handy because when I put my, my sports bras in the washer and the dryer, I'm bad, I don't hang them up. But when I put them in the dryer, the cup gets like destroyed if it's not <laughs> actually part of the bra. So um, that's definitely helpful. This bra, it's got a higher neckline as you can see, like I'm not spilling out as much as I was in the other, the lower impact bras. If you're gonna do something that's higher impact, I, I really recommend these guys. Plus, they're really, really soft. Like, they're really soft. It kind of reminds me of like an actual bra. You know, when you feel an actual bra and it's got that really soft kind of like satin feel to it, that's what this reminds me of. Now, I'm not 100% sure when I say this, but I think this is one of the few first bras that Gymshark has made where they actually like make the cups part of the bra so you don't have to like they're not removable or anything like that. I really think that was a good step in the right direction because I don't have the patience to put the cup back in the sports bra after it falls out when I wash it. So this is gonna save me a lot of time and yeah. I think for me, I think for me when I wear this, I'll probably have to adjust the straps a little bit so it's more up there and tighter just because I did get a size higher than I usually get. Typically when I get a sports bra, it just, it's like, like just sticks to me <laughs> but um, I definitely like the flexibility of having a bigger size because it allows me to just be more comfortable um, you know because my, my chest is changing so much I don't, even, I don't really know what's going on so uh, <laughs> it just lets me be comfortable uh, it comes in charcoal lilac ice and then it also comes in black so I really like that there's always a black option for these sports bras because that's like as, as typical and as basic as you can get and it's great that you have every single support in black because I know black, like everybody needs a, a solid black sports bra so it's great that black is, a, is an unavailable color for all of these. Okay, next up we have the high support sports bra. So this is what it looks like. It's got the pre-formed cups so once again you can't remove the cups because it's actually like part of the bra, so I've got two colors here. I'm just gonna use this as an example. So it's actually a part of the bra. It has 
the racer back stripes again. It has a really, this one has a really high neckline and part of it is mesh. Just like the last bra, we do have this, so it is like an actual bra where you can adjust the back. These straps are also adjustable, so you pretty much have support like up, down, around, you are covered. So for sizing for this one, I kind of have mixed feelings because like once I get the bra on, it fits perfectly, I don't have problems with it, like it's extremely comfortable and everything, but trying to get it on, it's like unless you have somebody to help you clasp the back, because um, I usually just like to slip them on like a shirt, I struggled quite a bit trying to get it on, but once I got it on, it fit perfectly, so I feel like I am kind of like in between sizes for this one, but I did get an extra small in these. I kind of wish I did get a size small, just so it would fit a little bit looser, but I feel like once you get it on, it gives you all the support that you need. Even just looking at the bra, like, it's a pretty sturdy bra. I can feel it in the bra, actually, there's a bit of an underwire, but it reminds me of the, uh, there's a Lisenza bra where there's an underwire, but it's padded. That kind of, like, what's going on here. So, I feel like this bra is great for anything high impact. Like, you could probably do anything in this bra and you'll be covered. So this bra comes in four colors. They're more neutral colors. It comes in your white and black. It comes in a nude color as well, which is probably gonna be super handy because um, a high support sports bra in the color nude, like, you can wear that anywhere. And then it also comes in this really nice burgundy color, which, I really like. Well, the final bra I'm gonna talk about, I'm just gonna show it to you before I actually put it on, just because there's a lot of detail in the back that needs to be talked about. So, this is the high support sports bra. This is also high support, but this is just a different high support. It has a lot going on in the back. So, we have the adjustable back clasp, which is super handy. We have the built-in cups with a little bit of an underwire going on here. So it's very, it's it'll support you. It has straps everywhere. Now I personally, I'm not a fan of the straps everywhere, but I do like what Gymshark has done here. They don't make the straps go all the way to the back, so they don't get all tangled up in your hair, because you kind of have this mesh area here, and then you can adjust the straps. So I'm gonna put this on. Okay, here we go. So as you guys can see, we have an incredibly high neck. So there is no way I'm going anywhere. <laughs> I got this bra in a size extra small and it fits perfectly. I don't have any complaints about it. It's not too tight, fits good, very soft. So I would say if you are usually a size extra small, definitely stick with an extra small. I'll just show you some of the details here. It does have this little mesh area here. Gymshark logo is here. There's kind of more than one layer to this bra, so you have like your original layer here, but then you have this other layer that gives you extra support here. And then I have this, I have actually have the straps adjusted like, so they're all the way down, like all the way tightened. Um, but you can also loosen them if you need to. So this comes in four colors. They're kind of more earthy colors. It comes in black. There's always a black one. This is Dusky Sage. It comes in smoky gray, and then it also comes in blue stone. Let's be honest, we all have very different needs. We all have very different chests. I know growing up personally, I've always been very insecure about my chest. Like my chest has always been my biggest insecurity. Like even in relationships, I'm like, Nope, no. So um, to find a sports bra or even just a bra in general that I feel confident in, that makes me feel good, you know, so I can go do my workout and feel great about myself. Um, I think that's the whole purpose behind this whole campaign is to just promote feeling confident in your own skin and your own body. My personal favorite out of all these bras I just talked about was the low to medium support. So the one with the little scrunch in the middle. The reason I like that is just because I've never had, you know, a big chest growing up. I've never really had boobs. So when I wear that bra and I have that scrunch and I just have that support, it just, I don't know. It makes me feel very feminine. Like it's kind of like pushing them up, but in a good way, in a way that's not like completely scandalous. It makes me feel like naturally I just have that and it makes me feel really good about myself. I've actually had a few people ask me <laughs> if I got my boobs done and no, I do not have a disposable 10 grand 
don't plan on getting them done. I did want to get them done very badly uh, before, just because I was so, like as I was competing and my, and my chest was shrinking because I was losing body fat, I just became very insecure about my chest and it was hard for me to feel confident in sports bras because I was just flat. And still to this day, I do still have an insecurity with my chest, like I think that's always gonna be something, but um, there's definitely ways around it and ways to feel better about it and embrace it. And I'm learning to definitely embrace it. And with having a, a range of sports bras like this where I can find what works best for me and feel good in something like like the low to medium support where I'm like, damn, I actually kind of have something going on. It's It definitely helps. I'd probably say the most important thing here is just to find something that makes you feel confident. So thank you guys so much for watching. I really hope I gave enough information so you could make a decision on the sports bra. If you have any questions at all, please feel free to comment below or you can send me a message on Instagram. I'm pretty responsive on Instagram. I check my DMs quite often just in case somebody asks me about anything Gymshark. If you do want to order a sports bra, you can shop through my Gymshark commission link, which would be greatly appreciated because it does support me directly. So if you wanted to do that, I would be very appreciated and do let me know so I can thank you personally. I really hope that that uh, you find a sports bra that is perfect for you and that makes you feel confident and you know just feel your best self. Have a fantastic rest of your day and I will see you in the next video.